Hey everybody! Welcome back to another episode of Cheng Zhang Hanyu, Growing Up with Chinese. Now, seeing as a lot of you are still in school, and for those of you who aren't, life is one big school, isn't it? Anyway, it seemed appropriate to have one of our shows focus on school, as well as all the vocabulary that comes with this territory. Now, the last time we saw Mike and Xiaoming, they had just arrived late to class. Last show, Lan Lan was deep in discussion with her classmates on the topic of pets. So, how did their day end up? Did their bad luck streak finally come to an end? Let's go check it out. Shangshu 你每科成绩都那么好。哎呀,好了好了。啊,那今天你们老师留作业了吗? 嘿,哥们,加我一个! Well, it looks like they all made it through the day pretty much unscathed, although Xiaoming does look a little scruffy. Now, it seems that classes and homework were the main topic of discussion today. And I guess their Black Monday, or 黑色星期一, isn't quite over just yet. Let's take a look at some specifics. Lan Lan, ni ke bu zhi dao. Woman zao shang shui guo tou la, shang xue chi dao la. Lan Lan, you have no idea. We slept too late this morning and we were late for class. Shui guo tou is a set expression that means to sleep in, as in woke up later than we should have. Ni men jing tian you ti yu ke ma? Do you guys have gym class today? Jing tian means today, and ti yu ke is gym class. 你们今天有体育课吗? Did you guys have gym class today? 有,有两节体育课. Yes, we had two periods of gym class. 节 is the measure word for class. 两节体育课. Two periods of gym class. 放学喽,回家喽。今天真是黑色星期一啊。黑色星期一?为什么? 我们早上睡过头,上水吃到了。还有呢,上课没带书。你们呀。哎,小明,你们今天有体育课吧?有啊,有两节体育课,你怎么知道的?看你身上这么脏,我就知道有体育课。哈,Lanlan is giving Xiaoming a hard time. This means, looking at how dirty you are, I knew you had gym class today. 就知道 is an emphatic way to say, I know, or I knew. 哎,小明,你们今天有体育课吧?有啊,有两节体育课,你怎么知道的?我看你身上这么脏,就知道有体育课。嘻嘻嘻,there it is. Oh, okay. 你喜欢上什么课? What classes do you like? 喜欢 means like. 你喜欢上什么课? 我喜欢上英语课,不喜欢上数学课. I like English class and I don't like math class. 英语课 is English class, 数学课 is math class. 我喜欢上英语课,不喜欢上数学课. 今天你们老师留作业了吗? Did your teacher give you any homework today? 留 is the verb used with homework or 作业. Liu in this context means leave, 留作业, to leave homework or give homework. 
，今天你们老师留作业了吗？当然了，每科都留了。Of course, every subject has a homework assignment. Now, because this sentence is preceded by a question, it's obvious. That homework is the topic of discussion, so 作业 doesn't necessarily have to be used in the answer. 放学喽，回家喽。今天真是黑色星期一呀、啊。黑色星期一？为什么？兰兰，你可不知道，我们早上睡睡过头，上学迟到了。还有呢，上课没带书。你们呀？哎，小明，你们今天有体育课吧？有啊，有两节体育课，你怎么知道的？我看你身上这么脏，就知道有体育课。兰兰，我特别喜欢上体育课，你呢？你喜欢上什么课？我嘛，我喜欢上语文课，不喜欢上数学课。切，我看你什么课都喜欢，你每科成绩都那么好。<笑>哎呀，好了好了，啊，那。今天你们老师留作业了吗？当然了，每科都留了。黑色星期一还没有完。那你们去我家写作业吧。好啊好啊，小明你呢？啊，写作业，麦克你去吧，我有事儿。你有事儿？有什么事儿啊？我，他们叫我呢。嘿，哥们儿，加我一个。All right, everybody. Let's take a look at today's vocabulary. First, we'll go over today's specific vocabulary words, and then we'll move on to the radical of the day. So our first word is "zang," dirty, filthy. "Zang," 喜欢 like, 喜欢上课 to have class, to attend class, 上课当然 ，of course。当然，留 ，leave，leave leave behind， 留，完 ，finish， 完，体育 ，physical education， 体育，语文 ，Chinese language class， 语文。数学 math, arithmetic. 数学 Today we're going to be looking at the word or language radical. It's called the 言字旁 and we can see it in all kinds of characters. So let's look at two from today. Today we saw the 言字旁in 语文的语 as well as. 数学课的课 ，OK， 语文的语，数学课的课。Now, if we break these characters apart, we can see that the language radical or word radical is on the left side of both characters. Now, as a character on its own, yen looks like this. In its original form, looks like that. Now, I'd say that these two characters really don't look all that similar. But if you try writing yen very quickly, you just might get something that looks like it's radical. So, yu means word or language, and ke means class. Now, both have a lot to do with words and language. Education is, without a doubt, one of the most important things we receive in life. Be it at home or at school, we're always learning, aren't we? Now, seeing as Mike and Xiaoming's day at school is over, we thought it might be interesting for all of you to hear about how education works in China. In ancient times, before school was mandatory for all, there were private schools where families would send their children, especially boys. Now, receiving an education was considered quite a luxury, and if you wanted to get a government job, you had to complete mandatory classes at an imperial school, 
and pass an incredibly difficult exam that lasted literally for days. Students would be locked into cubicles that contained a table, paper, a calligraphy brush, and a chamber pot for when they needed to go to the bathroom. Today, everyone gets the chance to have an education. Primary or elementary school is grades 1 through 6, middle school is grades 7 through 9, and high school is grades 10 through 12. The average course load of a middle school student includes math, English, Chinese, uh, physics, chemistry, gym, politics, uh, history, geography, and music. Now, when kids hit high school, they declare a focus in either the humanities or sciences, and the courses adjust accordingly. Now, there are a growing number of international students that attend Chinese schools these days, be it elementary, middle, or high school. We will start out by looking at 喜欢, to like. 我喜欢他, I like him. 我喜欢英语课, I like English class. Now, if you were to say 我喜欢英语, it would simply mean I like English. The 课 in 英语课 is the word for class or subject. So, 英语课 is English class. Now, to turn 喜欢 negative, you use 不. 不喜欢, don't like, doesn't like. 他不喜欢我, he doesn't like me. 我不喜欢上课, I don't like to go to class. Let's take a look at some more examples of 喜欢 and 不喜欢. 兰兰, 我特别喜欢吃川菜, 你喜欢吗? 我不太喜欢, 川菜太辣了, 我喜欢吃上海菜, 儿子, 看, 我给你买了件运动服,你喜欢吗? 哇, 真漂亮, 我太喜欢了。Let's take a look at 上课. 上 in this case means to attend, just like 上学 means to attend school. When Mike and Xiaoming were trying to get to school a couple of shows ago, we covered the verb 去, 去学校, to get to school, to go to school. 上 is attend. 上学, 上课. If you need to add an adjective to 上课, it goes in between 上 and 课, just like adding math to attend class. You attend math class, right? 上英语课, 上数学课. 哎, 兰兰, 今天下午上什么课? 嗯,我看看。今天下午上英语课和体育课。有体育课啊,太棒了。阿姨,请问兰兰在家吗?小明啊,兰兰不在,他去上钢琴课了。当然, of course. This is pretty straightforward. Its use is essentially the same as English, of course. Notice though that in today's dialogue, it came up as 当然了。Lanlan Lan asked Mike, 今天你们老师留作业了吗? School's over when the dialogue takes place, so Lan Lan is referring to what has already passed, hence the use of le in her question. So Mike's response needs to follow Lan Lan's pattern, and this is why he says, 当然了,每科都留了很多作业。今天晚上,你愿意来看我的钢琴表演吗? 当然了,这是我的荣幸。你们喜欢作业吗? Do you all like homework? 我今天不留作业。I won't leave you with any today. If you want to review anything we've covered, though, feel free to check out our website. And if you don't find what you're looking for, leave us some feedback. 不要忘了,don't forget. 好的。we're out of time today, but I shall see you all very, very soon. Jiao, everyone. Xia Zijian. See you next time.